Hi everybody, I'm Sips. Welcome back for some more towns. Um, God. We, we made some good progress last time, actually. We, uh, we got a lot of bread. A lot of bread made. And, uh, and as you can see, everybody's just starting to get hungry now. So they're all making their way over to the stockpile and, uh, and eating the bread. And, and in some cases, sleeping on the stockpile. I guess, uh, I guess it's comfortable to make just like a big mountain of loaves of bread and, uh, and, and sleep on it. So, um, so there we go. That's, that's, that's Arabella for you. Um, and, uh, and, and that's great. Hopefully she's not like sweating too much on that bread because uh, other people have to eat that. And, uh, you know, you, you sweat about like a, like a pint glass worth of sweat every night. So if she's getting like a, like a full sleep on all that bread, uh, that's pretty disgusting. But, um, but we'll forgive her because we need her to, uh, to help us build up Sipsville. So here we go. We're, uh, we're going to build uh, some sort of structure today. And uh, let's just see how we're doing for stone down here. We've got a little bit of stone. And, uh, we could probably do with getting a little bit more. So let's, uh, let's mine some out down here. Just holding shift um, so that I can keep sort of clicking to, uh, to mine stuff out. And that way I can just do things like this. Um, you know, I don't want to dig out too much dirt. I just want to mine out all the stone down here. And, and that's fine. We got a little bit of stone from that. So um, I'm just going to head back up here. And, uh, and I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to make some walls. And uh, where the hell do we want to put our first building? God, I don't even know. We're going to eventually dig out all this coal. So we'll have like a nice little coal mine close to our town. And uh, this stone has been all dug out. We've got some gravel here. More stone up here and here. And some beautiful flowers. Blue and red flowers. Okay, let's uh, let's build our first um, house here. Be fine, and uh, and we're gonna make it a bakery as well, uh, an indoor bakery, so that these people can uh, really start pumping out the bread uh, in, in in the safety of some sort of shelter. So so let's let's do that. So first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna get some walls down, and we're gonna do we're gonna make stone walls with all that stone that's down there, and uh, and stone walls don't decay, which is very good. So here we go. Again, I'm just gonna hold shift, and uh, we'll make it we'll make it pretty big, big enough anyway, big enough to uh, just bake a shitload of bread, and uh, hopefully as big as the Gregs that I'll that I'll own one one of these days. One of these days it'll be a reality. I don't know when. Okay, so there we go. These these guys are all gonna start building these uh, <laughs> building these stone walls, and they, they look like stone cabers. They're just gonna go do a caber toss with, uh, with these big stone pillars, which is nice. But um, we also need to get some wood. And, uh, we probably don't want to go too far over this way because of all these stupid frog guys. So let's see if there's anything a little bit closer to home uh, that we haven't already chopped down. Oh, here we go. There's a decent patch here. And um, we want this wood because we want to build a door uh, for our new house. Um, I'm also going to chop down a couple of trees here too. Not too far though. I don't want these guys like going all the way to the other end of the map. But, um, you know... There's nothing we can do about that. God, look at all the wheat. Okay, we've just got a shit ton of wheat now, all sitting there. I'm going to start actually accepting wheat on the stockpile too. These guys, so that they don't have to walk all the way out to the farm, grab a piece of wheat and come back to the mill. But hopefully, once uh, once these guys are all done gathering wood, bringing it back to, uh, to Sipsville, they'll, uh, they'll go and start picking up some of this wheat and putting it here. And um, we're eventually going to have to get... Actually, I'm just going to make a barrel. I'm going to make a barrel to put the flour in. We'll put it into the new bakery when it's done. So let's carve out a zone for the bakery as well. And Oh, this is going to be great to watch. Check this out. This is going to be so good. I'm just going to make it this big. And then I'm going to get them to dig a hole here. Because we're going to make we're gonna make a basement in the bakery. God, that's fantastic, isn't it? And then what we can do is expand the bakery. And uh, there we go. We can just expand it out. So this one hole here is going to be the... Uh, the basement. We're building a basement in, in the bakery uh, and then we can store stuff in the basement and and even have somebody's house down there. So whoever is going to be, can't really designate anyone to be a baker, but whoever is down there is, is more likely to, uh, to to do a lot of baking because it'd be so close to all the um, the baking apparatus. So there we go. Um, I got a ladder on there and then we'll, we'll dig it out eventually. Oh look, there's, there's the coal. Pretty close to the coal. But yeah, we'll dig out this area down here and then we can we can put his living quarters down there. Get some barrels down there to store some flour and some other shit too. Some some baked breads. Okay, so 
These guys are slowly filling the uh, stockpile up with wheat, which is fine. Um, we don't want too much wheat in there, but uh, it's a bit inevitable. And look at... Nobody's making bread now, except for this guy. He's, he's making some flour. And, uh, and maybe Sedany, um, well, now she's sleeping on, no, that was Arabella last time. Sedany's decided to sleep on the wheat, uh, which is also disgusting. I actually, I don't know which is more disgusting, sleeping on the, uh, the raw material needed to make food or sleeping on the finished food itself. Probably both are equally disgusting, although, arguably, um, all, all of, uh, Sedany's sweat will be just, like, cooked away. Um, and, you know, it'll make the, uh, bread taste saltier, so... Not soggy, but just salty. And that's pretty disgusting. So it looks like we got some, uh, somebody's rumbling with a frog over there. It's, uh, Anastas kicking a frog. Um, try, trying their best to kick a frog. And, uh, the froggy in return is, ah, oh, yeah, Anastas, great job. Killed a frog. I don't know where. Uh, there's no way of double-clicking here to, like, go to the action, which is a shame, because, like, you miss out on so many cool frog fights, but go. Should be good for stone, so this this will get finished eventually. And uh, these people are starting to get hungry now, and they haven't really built up a, a backlog of, uh, of bread, which is a shame. Just gonna see what's going on here. Let's see if we can just pump this up and get somebody on the case. I don't know if this is gonna work, but hopefully it does, because, God, listen, there's just a ton of munching going on in the background there. Everybody's getting hungry. Here we go. Dropping the wheat off into the mill, making some flour leaving it in front of the mill like a lazy bastard. You lazy bastard, who are you? It's Jasmine. God, Jasmine's a lazy bastard. Okay, here we go. Here's some bread, and uh, somebody's just come and picked it up straight away, put it into the stockpile, and uh, oh, here we go. Jordy LaForge is coming to eat the bread. That's okay, we replaced it straight away. Okay, we're gonna have to get another stockpile set up for, uh, for flour too, and we're gonna start um, storing the flour right here, just for now. So let's just disable everything here and enable flour. And hopefully somebody will just start making a lot of flour and putting it in there. That would be nice. So hopefully Jordy does up. That's not Jordy, it's Demetrius. Looks like Jordy though. Jordy from Star Trek. Oh yeah. Okay. So um, instead of actually creating 10 breads uh, like I thought they would, it looks like they're just creating bread and then eating it straight away, which is not really sustainable. Uh, we're going to run into problems eventually, um, which is a bit of a shame. And look at all this extra wheat. God, there's a ton of wheat. We really invested a lot of lumber into uh, <laughs> into these wheat fields. And uh, wow, they're yielding. Um, but uh, unfortunately, everybody is, is too stupid to, uh, to bake a lot of bread or, or even store up a lot of flour. See, like they, they just want to sleep. And, uh, there's people over here fighting frogs. I think they're over here. Oh yeah, look, it's uh, it's Bryce. Bryce is just wandering off into the wilderness, probably because he's hungry. He wants to kill a pig. He's gonna, he's probably gonna kill some sort of pig or badger. Oh, who's this? Good God, it's Malakin. Malakin from Heroes of New Earth in uh, in Townsperson form. So already we're we're facing. A potential disaster, a, a, a little mini disaster, um, in that we have tons of wheat. Uh, we could have tons of flour, but uh, people are too sleepy or hungry to uh, to bother making any bread. Um, Anastas here is just going to probably starve to death because she's too stupid to um, to walk a couple of paces and get a, a piece of bread. Oh, actually, no. Malakin has decided to uh, eat that bread, um, and is probably spitting in Anastas's face right now, saying. F you, I called that bread from the other side of the map, and I came to get the bread. So, so here's some flour. Oh god, look at all this flour. Come on, Malakin, please. Make some... Oh yeah. Okay, you just keep making the flour, and, uh, and you can just watch Jordy starve to death in fr right in front of your very eyes, uh, because you refuse to bake bread. That's a good idea. Okay, here comes Arabella. Arabella the hero, making, making a quick loaf of bread, and uh, if my predictions are... Oh no! Oh, thank God. Thank God Demetrius has had some bread. And we got Bryce on the case now. Bryce is going to start baking some bread. And uh, really, we could do with... Uh, oh, I think maybe we're out of stone, actually. No, we've got stone. Um, people are just too hungry and tired to actually uh, continue making the walls. Except for... Uh, is that... No, that's Arabella. Good job, Arabella. We really need some flour. And uh, we really need some bread. Uh, 
I mean, at least Demetrius is, like, taking the initiative. Everybody else is just stupid. But, uh, but there we go. So, um, slow, slow progress, but, you know, we're getting there. I think we could probably actually the instructions to, uh, to start digging some of this crap out, too. Uh, just start small-ish. Just to see. We need, we need this area for a living quarters. Um, just thought. It's, it's control to see through walls, by the way. Yeah, and we have a, a ladder. Um, we just don't have anyone available because um, basically half the town is now starving to death uh, because we haven't made any bread. It's pretty dumb. That's, that, is, that is pretty dumb. Four breads. Let's just stop that again. Come on, make some more bread, please. Good job, Bryce. I, I think you just have to like cheer them on a bit. And we got three people starving here now. Still got some wood coming in. Maybe we like set the wood order. It's too big. Oh, here we go. Somebody, somebody else is eating now. And uh, I don't know why these guys are all in the wheat fields. I mean, we have more than enough wheat. Really, we just need to concentrate on... Maybe it's something to do with the priorities, actually. Maybe I just missed that. Baking and cooking. No, that's like the highest priority. So they should be... Uh, let's get hauling. Ooh, maybe maybe that's something to do with... Hauling after gathering. There we go. Wall construction, we'll put last. We d we're not too worried about wall construction. We don't want them to be making walls over... Potentially uh, making food. We really need to like save these guys from dying uh, if we can. Oh god. This is a really critical part of, in the game. So early on too. God, food production. I thought I, I thought I had an ace there with the food production, but I'm not. And um, Malakin is just so selfish. Just, just, just doing her own thing. She just thinks, oh fuck you guys. I want to build a wall. I don't want to bake any bread or, or create any flour you know, mine. Oh no, now she's gonna starve. So, um, so there you go. That's, that's true justice at play right there. Oh god. Jesus. Demetrius. Come on. No, no, that's, that's Robin. Robin, who I didn't even know was here, is now eating the bread. And well, that's fine. The rest of these guys don't even have an excuse. I mean, they're not even, let's start killing some badgers. Just for good measure. And let's also, um, kill some chickens too. God this rooster. Come on, rooster. Take some of this. Maybe they'll just eat the raw meat. Oh, yeah, there we go. Have some raw badger meat, somebody, if you're hungry. And, uh, this chicken, too. Why the hell not? Let's just kill this cow and rooster. Let's get every everybody something to eat. And a, and a boar. Here we go. We'll just completely pillage all of Mother Nature's beauty now, just so these people can eat and be productive. Um, okay, we need to build a door now, too, uh, for our, um, whatchamacallit, and that's in, uh, what's furniture? Yeah, it's furniture. Here we go, wooden door. Stick a wooden door there, and, uh, and finally our bakery is taking shape. Oh, look it, this is all, like, dug out now, too. So the living quarters is going to be 3x3, three three, and then we'll, we'll also get some storage down here, too. Make another 3x3 three three area. Um, no, let's make it 4 so that we can put, like, a wall. Yeah, that'd be good. We'll put a little wall to separate it out. Actually, let's just dig this out a little bit more. Somebody's going to get some luxury accommodation down here. They're going to be pretty lucky. And uh, I don't know who it's going to be, but we'll see. We'll see who it is. Okay, so we go to zones, we go to personal room, and uh, whoever gets this, God, is, is in the money big time. Who could it be? It's, oh yeah, it's Bryce's room. Thank God. Bryce is actually pretty good. And let's uh, let's get some stone walls put in down here too. And a door. Get a door on his room too. And then this little area can just be like a storage area. That'll be fine. And we'll build him a bed and stuff too. See, look, Bryce is already sleeping in his room even though it's covered in mud and shit. And uh, there's no furniture. What a trooper. So so there we go. A, a beautiful bakery. And uh, we can start moving some of this stuff in. Um, but instead of actually moving it in, we'll just build some new stuff so that we have um, some more output. So here we go. Let's get a baker's oven, get another baker's oven, and uh, let's get another baker's table too. And, um, oh, I think I'm out of wood. No, I'm not out of wood. Get a baker's table there. And uh, another baker's oven. There we go. Should have enough stone for that. Hopefully. If not, we'll just get some more though, that's fine. Dig another hole here. And, uh, and start mining that out. 
Okay, so I think crisis averted for now. We've got tons of wheat, but nobody seems to actually be hungry at the moment. And I think that's just because we, we went off and we killed a lot of stuff. And we can kill some more stuff. It's it's fine. Just just to make sure that everybody's got enough to eat. So um so not bad going actually. Um although I think we need to get a ladder here and get some more stone. Oh no, there we go. Baker's oven. Fantastic. God, great work, you sons of bitches. Let's get some uh some raw food barrels down here too. And um Let's get two. We'll get two. And we'll, we'll store flour in there. The baker's flour. So that whoever comes in here and starts baking, they can go down into the basement and grab some flour and then come up and make some bread. And then we can put some uh, some uh, prepared food barrels here for the bread. And the people can come in here and eat bread. Um, which will do for now. That's fine. But we don't want people clogging up the bakery too much. So we'll, we'll, we'll build them like a dining hall and stuff eventually as well. And that'll be fine. Um, but yeah, I think, uh, I think for now, that's probably enough. Um, I'll end the episode here, and, um, stay tuned for the next one. We'll, we'll build some sort of dining hall, and, uh, and we'll also try to get people making some more bread, because it, ideally it'd be nice to have, like, a backlog of bread. I don't know why they're not, uh, not, not making bread that I thought they would. I'll also get Bryce a bed, too, so he can go to sleep, and, uh, and that'll be nice. And eventually... Once we get more houses and stuff, we can start expanding our population and building an army, and then we can go fuck everything up. We can go kill all the frogs, we can go down in the dungeon and kill a bunch of spiders and stuff. God, it's going to be sweet. Sipsville's going to be just, like, beautiful. It's going to be decked out in gold and everything. Or everyone will die next episode. Who knows? Uh, it's so hard to tell. But, uh, yeah, as usual, thanks for watching, and, uh, and I'll catch you for the next one.